Jewish history in a nutshell. This is what we have presented to us at the commencement of Parshat Lech Lecha, where Hashem gives seven blessings to Avraham, the founder of our faith. Two of those blessings are, Umakalelecha Aor, Hashem says, I will curse those who curse you, and all families on earth will be blessed by you and your descendants. Why are these two blessings appearing alongside one another? The Sefer Mayanashel Torah suggests as follows. Sometimes he says, we can be exceptionally kind to a person. Sometimes that person might even depend upon our kindness for his or her existence. Yet, not only is there no appreciation, but they actually give us a lot of trouble. This, Hashem says, is what will happen to the Jewish people through the ages. I will curse those who curse you. Sadly, there will sometimes be nations who will curse the Jewish people, who will hate us and resent us for our very existence. And this will happen even though we, the Jewish people, give a contribution of inestimable value wherever we are in the world. Here we have Jewish history in a nutshell. So very often there will be deep appreciation and true friendship that we will benefit from. But sometimes there will be darkness for the Jewish people as a result of the trouble that we will endure. But don't worry, says Hashem. You can't have light without shade, and no shade can destroy that light. Despite the darkness that the Jewish nation will endure, I will guarantee, says Hashem, that you, the Jewish people, will continue to shed light for the world indefinitely. Am Yisrael Chai, the Jewish nation will live on forever. So therefore, let us not allow the ingratitude that is sometimes shown to stop us from giving kindness to others and let us as a nation not allow the darkness that sometimes exists for us to stop us from fulfilling the blessing given to Abraham for us to be a continuous blessing for everyone on earth through the contribution that we must give always to our environment. Shabbat Shalom.